Dude, I don't know how you slice this portal. Like, that is... <laughs> that's, like, modern Minecraft technical stuff. And just to have it just sitting right there. <laughs> Hilariously, it is it is so much easier in beta than it is in modern. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, all, all of these things, like, they're... They're a little bit janky, but like they are, they are so much easier. I like your skin, by the way. Thank you. It's an old one, and it just happened to work. It so... works. It works well. What's this little? Uh, my skin tones got... are. Wait, you've got out. like a little sugar cane in your back pocket, and then like a little sapling in your front pocket. I have. N I think. I don't know. I think I looked up Lewis and Clark skin, and uh -huh. and then I just stole it. Nice. I know some of them, and I have ideas for some places, but. Anything else, I think we can just put in the mansion. Okay. I think that would honestly be pretty pretty cool. Yeah. Well, I mean, I'll I'll take you through uh I'll take you through like kind of the basics of everything, and then you know you'll be able to hopefully know what to do with at that point, like with all the uh, all the glitches. Wait, wait. Um, okay, so where 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 do you want to do this? I I don't need uh, heaps of space, but like. But we have we can throw stuff in the mansion. <laughs> All right, let's do it in the mansion. <laughs> this this will be how I get out of doing the interior. Yeah, just fill it with uh with glitch glitch blocks. I yeah. like that you've surrounded this with uh with spruce trees. This looks nice with those around. Yeah, and that was my excuse for not doing an exterior. <laughs> <laughs> we uh we were doing like the lot the one year anniversary stream the, the other day and i noticed the back of the mansion is is just a big flat wall of, of oak wood <laughs> <laughs> the thing is, you can't see it from my yeah no, so it's not I a really problem know. out of yeah. sight out of mind hey you, you really. you're, you're truly uh truly becoming a green type <laughs> not doing the back of the back of bills <laughs> this is very far from green uh, yes i do see the resemblance yeah I uh, should be good to go. All right, cool. What is the first one? All right, so I'll. All right, as you know, beta is super glitchy, but I'll uh, I'll take you through just some 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 basic ones first, and then we'll we'll slowly increase in the in this quote unquote complexity. Oh my gosh, he knows <laughs> viewer retention. <laughs> <laughs> um, We're saving the glitched portal for the last. Exactly. Yeah, you know what's up. You know what's up. You okay. Have to keep watching. Yeah, I'll start you. With, I'll start off with like the the super basic one. I think uh, everyone probably knows about this one at this point, which is the the, the crash lab. Very simple. Oh, very simple. I'm very familiar with it. Yeah. So it's it's different to uh. To, do you have the crash lab fix now or? No, I keep uh, crashing. I'll have to. I might have to send them in my chest. I might have to send that one to uh, to you as well. But yeah, there's a there's a fix that gives it a name. The reason like it crashes your game is uh is because it doesn't have a name. Um, but I have a fix for that. So uh, now it uh now it doesn't crash my game. But that's a pretty cool one. That one's very. That one's obviously a basic one. But with wait, the same wait, thing. Wait, wait, wait. I. How did that happen? Uh, I mean, so so you put down you put down the the the. the is that it? Yeah, you put down the cobblestone slabs, and then you put a, uh, a redstone torch down, and then it just turns into that. So it's called, like, transmutation, um, oh. and it's to do with, like, I don't know, switching the ID values of blocks. It's uh, it's kind of confusing. I'm not really, uh, yeah, not really 100% sure how it works, honestly. <laughs> um, people much smarter than me can probably explain it better. Uh-huh. So uh, do we need to maybe have some slabs on me? Oh yeah, so want, to, oh I yeah, to compare, show, like, yeah, definitely unique compare. Unique about it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. we'll have to go to my base. Oh, so uh, how do I get these out of my inventory? Uh, so you can like, gra so with, you can gr like pick up another block, switch it with, another, like switch it with that block, and then uh, yeah. uh, switch it again with another block in your hotbar, and then you can like throw them out of your. For kicks and giggles, I should show what it does. <laughs> All right. You just hover over it, and you're just now I have to reset Minecraft. So yeah, completely crash the game. Yeah, it's a. Yes, it's, I get it out. It's interesting. Yeah, it should probably like probably explain that the the uh, like that smooth stone texture of um of of that block like it doesn't exist in beta. Like, you can't smell. Yeah, that's you can't it smell. Like, yeah. Oh, that's the standard block. Yeah. Wow, yeah. That, Oh, cool. Uh, yeah, so that's what it normally there? looks like. Oh, uh, place yours there. Oh, okay. Yep. Yeah, now we got some decoration. Yeah. So that's what it that's what it normally looks like. Hey. Oops, sorry. <laughs> See, like no, yeah. No matter what you do, like it's just gonna have that line. Yeah, and normally I think you smelt you smelt cobblestone into smooth stone, and then you smelt smooth stone into this one, but that doesn't work mm -hmm. in in beta. Um. 
but the texture still existed apparently because you can transmute cobblestone <laughs> slabs into <laughs> into that. So yeah, kind of cool. Can you pass me some slabs? Yeah. There you go. Do you? So how does and this? A torch. Like, why does this work? So, oh, so okay, you have to put the redstone okay, so torch I in. I do not know how it. to yeah. do it. So you have to put the so yeah, put that on the slabs. You have to put the redstone torch there, and it kind of it pushes into the redstone torch. Oh. Yeah. Um. Yeah, it, it, it's it's to do with like the changing like state of the, uh, um, like the ID of the block. So yeah. Oh, so it just changes what block it is. Kind of, yeah. It just yeah, it pretty much just changes what block it is. Yeah, and and you can do this with um with wool as well. I don't have, oops, I don't have. I wonder if it'll work with pink. I'm not sure. Um, this one doesn't really. Oh, there you go. Yeah. So what? It, it changes, Wait, I have yeah. never seen this. <laughs> it changes like the, the color of wool as well. Um, but we we're... is it always the lime or is it like different for every color? It's like it's it's directional and it uh, it's directional dependent on the way the uh, uh, the redstone torch is. So if I put this here, I think, and then I put this there. There you go. Now it changes what? a different Wait. color. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Actually. Can can you get brown wool from this? Um, I'm maybe uh maybe <laughs> I think you might be able to. Sorry, move out of the way. I might try this direction as well. I can't I can't remember. I I don't often use the like the wool changing color thing just because oh like some people you know would consider it like cheating. But <laughs> I feel like it's alchemy. They've added alchemy to Minecraft. Alchemy. <laughs> this is actually. It is kind of like magic a so little bit, cool. isn't it? Cool. You just change what color it is. Wait, yeah. can we change like orange's color then? Um. Yeah. Maybe. Oh. It's still. <laughs> maybe try like putting. Like if we put like a, like like the torch on the other side like that. Oh, it changes back, back to yellow. yellow. So yeah. So it changes. I think depending on the direction, it changes it like a specific oh. color. Uh, so okay. if we like if we were to build it like this way, maybe it would be a different color. I don't know. Let's uh, let's try. Oh, still lime. <laughs> okay, so it probably swaps between just a couple colors. Yeah, I think it, I think. Oh, there no. you go. There's a different color. Oh. Yeah. So it's. I don't. Uh, yeah. I, it's probably pretty limiting in terms of like it's probably not going to change every color, but. Um, yeah, it definitely does change colors. It'll be something something for you to experiment with, I think. Uh, you know, which way uh, creates which color. That is, dude, I'm just going to be messing with that. Because, <laughs> whoa, whoa, I feel like I don't know how much I need to explain about beta Minecraft, but wool <laughs> is a pain to get. You it can only really get pain. it. You can't breed sheep or make sheep farms. Yeah. You just have to, like, yeah, go you to just... the spider farm, really. Yeah, you go to the spider farm. I Honestly, the best way to get, like, like copious amounts of wool is actually just every time you see a sheep shear it like that's every single time you see a sheep die it and mm. shear it like that's that's what i find is the the most most effective way all right so that's the that's the first one. Uh, oh, i actually uh this actually an extension of this hey, one sorry that i think I, there's a spider in my house yeah we gotta kill him i can uh, hear it if, if you press f3 you can see him uh he's probably Below us? Yeah. Yeah, oh, there he is. Oh, right there. there you are, you little rascal. Yeah, go kill him. Do you have torches on you? Yeah, I do. Oh, no, I don't. Sorry. <laughs> uh, let's take one of these torches. Yeah. Hello, spider. Freaking interrupting our recording. And there's a zombie. <laughs> Jaren dies. No, no. We're fine. <laughs> it's just one spider. Ooh, we got our next one. Okay, so Wait, the, no, this is the no, this, this is the yeah. exact same one. <laughs> this is the exact same thing. <laughs> but but it is it is the same same thing, but it's sl like slightly different. So if you instead of putting like the the cobblestone slabs in, if you put um, any kind of stair, it could be a wood or it's uh, or it could be cobblestone. You put a stair in and then you place a block. It turns into Whoa! this. So Wait. this. Yeah, so this is an invisible Wait. invisible stair. Oh. Yeah, you can't jump on it. Um, you can break it. Um, so this is a pretty cool and unique block, actually. So um, something cool you can do with this. Yeah, it, it interacts. So something cool you can do th with this is you, you can throw items through it like that, um, which is really cool. And But you can also... Uh, I mean, you can also move it around with pistons like that, which is handy. Um, but... 
what is, is it stuck in my house? No, no, you can break this with a, you can break this with a pickaxe. It's basically like okay. a, a stone uh, stone stair. But what's cool about this, I mean, as you as you just like try it out, is it um, it doesn't uh, like it doesn't have like the water can't pass through it. Yeah, like that. So if you put like a bunch of these underneath water, like you can have like a little secret entrance, you know, underwater or something like that. Um, I know Doc. I know Doc did built one of those um, over by her place. Like you can jump into the water and then you drop through it. Um, and yeah, I've used it in um, in my uh, my wheat farm actually. <clears throat> that oh, I, I that did I recently see that. Built. Yeah, I used a bunch That's of these. Curious that you got that. Yeah, I, I used a bunch of these to make it so that like everything was kind of floating and there was no. Um, uh, yeah, no, like, uh, all the items could pass through it sort of thing. It's a, it's a pretty useful block, and it's kind of cool. Deadly Dirt Block also used it because mobs can, like, pathfind over it, so I used it for a uh, a really cool mob farm, uh, like, a really cool and efficient mob, like, mob grinder. So they, there. like, try to walk onto this block, and then they just fall through? Yeah, so kind of like kind of like how in modern um, mobs will try and walk over signs, you know? Um, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's the same same kind of idea. They'll try and walk over it, but they'll fall th like straight through it. And yeah, you can move it around. <laughs> I'm just gonna leave it there. Yeah. I, I can't <laughs> see it walking in. <laughs> like, oh yeah, so I have all my. Uh, I got this cool stone here. I got the wall on the ground. This just hit a block. <laughs> right there. There's a random like hitbox in the air. Yeah, so that one's pretty cool. I, I think this one's one of my favorite ones. Is like the invisible, uh, the invisible stairs. I think those are like they're very cool. They're they're they're, they're silently very useful. We we even use them to um to stint the uh, the growth of sugarcane over by the Mount Betamore. We made it so that like you know oh. only like that you know there's one or two sugarcane, but like we didn't want to grow like let it grow to three. So you know you put it on top and it stops it from growing. It also stops mushrooms from growing around. Like if you had a mushroom next to it and then you surround it with these, like the mushroom's not going to spread anywhere. Um, so yeah, mm -hmm. it is. It is quite useful for like niche things like that. So yeah, pretty handy and like to have something like that in beta for sure. That is so cool. All right, ramping up in in the uh, I don't know I guess coolness. Uh, if we this is this is a very simple one, but it's kind of funny. I don't know. I don't know how to space these out. I feel like we're we're not utilizing the space perfectly. Oh, uh, yeah. But... We can come over to the TV room. We we'll just uh, put it in the middle of the TV. Room. Okay, sure. Sounds good. Uh, I'll, I'll I'll build it this way. So if we go, uh, okay, it's been a little bit since I've uh, I've built one of these. Uh, like that, uh, like this, and then like that, and then if I put actually, you can, if, feel free. Take take a piston and place yeah. it place it on the front of the of this piston here. Whoa! <laughs> so that's a six-sided piston head right there. <laughs> and these all sides, piston. all sides, yeah. And these are really cool um, because they are like pretty, pretty durable. Like you, it's it's pretty hard to break them, as you see. Like you just tried to power it there. You can push the like, again. You can push this with a piston and uh, move uh -huh. it around, and it doesn't break, which is really cool. Like I, uh, you know, sometimes these little quirky things in beta. Wait, it doesn't break. break? No, no, no. Okay, no, no. Breaks. Okay. <laughs> but like, I was like, I'm trying to watch TV, box player. And I can't see. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Sorry, dude. I've just, I've just installed a permanent uh, coffee table in front of you. <laughs> uh, yeah. So, but like, yeah. The, the, the piston won't update. Is what I, what I meant. Is uh, it won't update, and uh, it'll just kind of float there. And the cool thing is, you can do this as well with, um, with sticky pistons as well. So, if, uh, oops. If you put this here. Uh, that's not correct, but there's a torch in my way. That's not correct either. This is bullying. You can cut this out, right? You can cut out my uh, my my all my blunders. Now everybody needs to know you're human. Is it is it <laughs> gonna be wrong of me to ask? Uh, do you know how these work? Uh, this one. Okay, so this one comes from. Why is this one? Okay, this one must also be directional. I'm. I I, I didn't realize this was also directional, but okay, um. Direct yeah, so this this one works, I think, like, so basically right here, when I do that, this piston is being, like, bud-powered, but it's not, like, it's not, it doesn't realize it's powered, so once you update it, so if I place that there, it's going to update, see? Oh. Um, and that's because of the redstone torch. Now, it, when you put the piston in front of it, I think for Wait, some... I want to try something. I, th I think when, nope, you, okay. when you put the piston in front of it, I think it just... 
Well, I, I, I don't, I'm not exactly sure why this happens. And then it just like, works. It just happens. I think, yeah. uh, again, it has something, I think it has something to do with the way that the, uh, the piston head is pushing into the other piston, and it just, it, like, it glitches out that block, that, that, you know, the, the piston block, and makes it six-sided for some reason. What but, yeah. happens if you, uh, like, break them? What do you get? Uh, I think it just gives you the piston back. Okay. Look at that. Now we, uh... Have a box in the middle of the living room. <laughs> so I use these ones for like more. Uh, the the good thing you know about these is like more decoration. You know, in beta you can't get enough you know extra things for decoration. So that's the same with the smooth stone mm -hmm. slabs. And then these I use these for like um, storage boxes over at my base. Um, yeah. You know, kind of kind of like uh, you know like shipping container boxes or whatever. Yeah, I'll go add it to my uh, mining facility when we're done. Yeah, I, think I think that's it's... where it could fit in well. Yeah, yeah. Because, yeah, it's more decoration because we don't have much. Yeah. As you can see, we've already resorted to note blocks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. you gotta got to find gotta find different ways. All right, and speaking of, like, more unique decoration blocks... Sorry, I picked up one of your torches. Gonna... He's got a transition! I've got a oh, transition! Dude, this is going to be such a good video. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so the next thing I have is... So... Uh, the like the body of a piston. So if I go like this, let me let me let me quickly let me quickly cook something up for you. So if I put that there, um, and then I need my my levers there, like this. Okay, so this is gonna create like the body of the piston without the piston head, like that. Okay. So this is another cool one. So obviously it's just like the body of a, a piston. And you can do this um, sideways like sideways as well using the same kind of method if I um, I'll quickly I'll quickly make one for you. So it's a piston pushing into a piston. You have a lever there that's active? No, this one's this one levers off. The the, the reason for this lever is to is to just to mess up with this this block here because Okay, so as this as this piston gets pushed across, this lever mm -hmm. that's active tries to power this block, but because it's going inside this lever, um, it like kind of just deletes the uh, the piston head because it's trying to extend and it just kind of deletes the piston head as it extends. Um, what the heck? Oh, that one disappeared. Uh, it's okay. I know where that was. That was uh, that was because I put it facing the wrong way. If I put that there, there we go. There we go. And then you get that. It's just the piston. Yeah. And um, so basically, right now, um, see how I've left these two blocks with the uh, yeah with the levers. So pretty much these are pretty uh, frail. So unlike the the this block here, these ones are pretty frail. As soon as you update mm -hmm. them, so if I put a block here, it's gonna. Oh, oh, it deleted your torch. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's gonna, it's gonna uh, so update it. I'm sorry. I'll have to. I'll, uh, I'll reimburse you. I've got plenty of torches. Don't worry. Um, so if I were to activate it, so here because the lever's still there, it's fine. Exactly. So when you're building, uh, like if you if you plan on building with this, like you leave sort of that activation uh, or like the you know this thing powering it until you're sort of done building around it. Or whatever, and then it's uh, and then it's good to go. Oh my gosh, it looks like a toilet, man! Oh, oh my god, it actually does. <laughs> it ate my water. Wait, it did not eat my water. <laughs> <laughs> That's actually a genius toilet idea. I didn't even think about that. That it looked like a toilet. Yeah. There we go. Yeah. I don't know what the lever is there for. To uh, poke you. Could be a could be a sink. What to poke you? What kind of toilets do you like, Jaren? It's a bidet, but it hits you in the back. <laughs> <laughs> uh huh. Let's keep it family friendly, huh? Okay. <laughs> what uh, what's next? All right, so that one's so that one's pretty cool. That one's like the you know piston head. I know um gory, which over oh, uh gory over that way. He's used a lot of them in his build, sort of sideways ones, so that it, um it looks kind of like uh like slits that you can shoot arrows through and I think you actually can shoot arrows through them so it's kind of like a I don't know like a military-ish kind of looking thing 
So the good thing about beta is like there's a lot of these things exist and they're uh, yeah they're a little complex and a little like finicky to do but they're not too hard to to kind of memorize which is cool. Um, all right, so the next thing is uh, so the same thing but the opposite. So we're gonna get the piston head without the body. Now this one um, this one I always kind of am bad at doing, but I'll try and do it. So um, the thing about the piston head is you can oh sad rain. Oh my okay. god! Turn down yeah. turn down the weather sound. clear. Can we weather clear? <laughs> Uh, I'm not gonna abuse my power as much as I'd love to. Please, <laughs> box player. Okay, I just turn off my sounds. Yeah, just turn them down. I'll, uh, lucky we're inside, so like you know the the video suppression isn't gonna gonna destroy us. Um, so this one, I'm, okay, this one I I'm uh bad at making. Is this floor hollow? Can I dig into this? You can dig into it. Okay, I might I might dig into this. So the thing about um, the piston head is that it can't really, like, you need a block under it to kind of keep it sustained, or, like, a block connected to it to keep it sustained. And, uh, yeah, that that's what we're going to do. So if you just watch out, I'm going to build it this way. Um, I'm going to put it on a... Let's put it on a, let's put it on a pink wall so it's, like, very obvious what's going to happen. We've got to, pat, like, bud power this piston block and then push it... Um, Basically, as it powers, we're going to push this uh, this pink wall underneath it. Uh, so. Oh, so like the piston goes up, and then the wall goes to the bottom part of it. Yeah, exactly. Oh. So that's yeah. how we. So that's how we bud power the piston there, and then if I put a block on top of that, oh, not like that. Difficult. There we go. If I put a block there like that, oh damn it. <laughs> <laughs> I've got not enough space. This is okay. There we go. I could throw that me there. some of your junk. I, I can be. I have a very empty inventory. All right, I'll chuck you. I'll chuck you these things that we've already uh, messed okay. around with. There you go. Thank you. You may or may not get these back. I do, That's okay. You can keep them. So I'll put that block there. There we go. Okay. And now what I'm gonna do is with this lever. So in in beta Minecraft, I don't know if you know this. You can left and right click to like activate levers and doors and things. So you can like just punch them. Yeah. Did you know that? Yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah, so, I knew that. So with this lever, I'm going to basically left and right click, like, really quickly. Uh, not quick enough, apparently. <laughs> oh, so this one you have to be, like, good at. Yeah, a little bit. Uh, okay. Oops. Okay, I need to... Every single time, you need to, like, reset the bud powering when you mess it up, which is annoying. Uh, and this might also be di directional. I, I don't think it is, but... Or at least I was okay. sure it wasn't. But... I'm going to give it a shot. Okay, sorry. Oh. I, I did it. See, I'm gonna do. I got it first try. Yeah, you're gonna get it first try. That's for sure. Thank you. See, look at you figuring it out. This. Yep. That's it. Okay, oh, so we, okay. Hang on. Wait, wait, wait. Hit. Hang on. The first thing. Wait, 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 wait. First thing, you gotta power this. Uh, power this. Uh, this piston. Uh, this lever here down like that. There we go. And then we gotta cover it. There we go. Nice. Okay, so left and right click, like at the exact same time, or is it like kind of one and right? For, after like you? pretty much as fast as you need, like as fast as you can. <laughs> so the same time. Yeah. There we go. Uh, Jaren is an absolute no redstone way. legend. Hell yeah. Yeah. So yeah, now we've got that, and this is useful for like you know like a table or something, and yeah, you can a table. you can put it on any block, um, which is cool. And yeah, basically after this. You can just remove everything around it, uh, except for obviously the block that it's sitting on. Mm -hmm. Our is, is chicken. Where, where did this? I'm sorry. <laughs> we what? We summoned him. <laughs> 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 He's just interested in the redstone, dude. He wants hey, to know. He you wants to know. Want to tour of what we've done so far? <laughs> where are you? Have you just been stuck under my house? Yeah, you have been. Okay. Well, have fun with that. Uh, how finicky is this? Like, does this break oh. easily? Like, if I update it? Uh, yeah. So this is another one that's quite finicky. If you ah, if you um place a block next to it, it'll disappear and and things like that. So you pretty much you want to have like all your infrastructure in before you put like before you put this in. Like the last thing you do in your in your build. So yeah. Mhm. Mm but it's a cool kind of table. There's also another um another way. Uh, let, let's uh, let's just cover this hole up a little bit. Up up up. There we go. Um, so you can also have them hanging as well, and then, uh, 
What block do you want it on, Jaren? I don't have... Let's do it. Let's do dirt. Dirt's fun. Mm, okay. Well, I kind of want my mansion to okay. look a little. Okay. Alright. Put, yellow, put I yellow. I got yellow wall. Okay. Yellow you wall. got yellow. Okay. Let's put that there. Floating dirt in my house. <laughs> Are you sure? I, I think about improve things. I do. Uh, the chickens might come back and think it's their home if there's dirt <laughs> in the sky. Okay, so this is basically the same uh, same thing, but just like in the air. Um, you need to power mm -hmm. this uh, uh, this piston block in a bit of a funky way. So if we put that there, power it, and then we go put this block here and a block on top. So I think that's all good to go. Mm -hmm. um, now, since you're such a pro, would you like to... Wait, hang on. Which yep. lever is it? Uh, this one here, right right in front of me. Okay. Yeah. Boom. Hey! Legend. Look at that. I'm just gonna sit there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, I use oh, this no. I use this one um, recently as, like, a connection for, like, a swing. Oh! oh. <laughs> That's a little awkward. You broke it. That's okay. Easy, easy fix. Easy fix. Yeah, I use this one for like a like a connection to a swing, uh, which looks pretty good in my opinion. I, so I put I put like um, uh, instead of having this yellow wool, I had fences, so it connected up to like the fences, you know, oh, in, a, in, a, in, a oh. cool, in a cool way. Um, I'll show you at my base at some point. It's uh, it's pretty cool. Um, so there, there. All right, let's go. Do it again. Oh wait 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 wait! Before you okay, <laughs> I was gonna say before you do it, you should uh, put the block underneath. But now it's floating. <laughs> uh, well, it wasn't that important anyway. <laughs> yeah. So these ones, uh, yeah, these ones are a little finicky. These are, like the last things you'll add in your, uh, in your build, um, because yeah, you place a block next to them and they'll update and disappear. Seen, yeah. yeah, which is unfortunate. Next yeah, thing. these have all been like very easy glitches to do that you could just simply pull them out. Like, exactly. Yeah. Like, Doing all this setup, I beta yeah. mine, they they just do not have a perfect game yet. It's, it's definitely a beta. They haven't it's released any a beta. for beta Minecraft. <laughs> yeah, Notch, Notch is, is lacking right now, but uh, hey, yeah. it's, it's benefiting us. We've got some cool glitches we can go through. And yeah, it's cool that mm -hmm. like they, they are easy to do, you know. Once you know how to do them, they're they're pretty easy and it's it's just it just makes it a bit fun. You know, it, 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 I wouldn't want to do like a, a ridiculously long setup because these are such cool blocks and it's cool to have them in builds. Um mm -hmm. Especially because like beta is limited in terms of like the building materials. It's like it's an investment to build like add these in a build, but it's not so much mm -hmm. an investment that it it's not worth it. You know, like it'll look you it makes something look unique. Exactly, exactly. You're like wow, Box you, did that. Yeah. Box <laughs> got his hands all over it. Yeah, exactly. Do do you have a kitchen in this place? Uh, we can just go to the second floor. Okay. Well, I was just yeah. Let's let, just for this next one. I think it'll be uh it'll be cool to. It's a. Uh... It's an outdoor kitchen. An outdoor kitchen. Yeah, I don't know if I, I, don't, I don't know balcony. if I I don't know if I have There's enough space. Fence. I don't know if I have enough space to. Uh, we can knock down walls to make this work. I won't. I don't. I'm not worried about it. <laughs> okay, <laughs> let's give it a try then. <laughs> um, I think yeah. I think if we yeah if we knock down that 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 should be good enough, and we can always add these walls in back again. I'll try and make it so that you can add these walls back. All right. So the next one we're going to be doing. I'm going to give you this these wood here. Um, the next one we're going to be doing is a, a furnace that burns forever. So, like, the lit fur basically the lit furnace texture will just, like, stick around, and it actually produces light as well. Oh. Um, okay, so, uh, let's go. I, I'm not sure if you can push this one with a piston after the fact. If we can, we'll try it out. Too much. Is this there. also messing with, like, the block ID where it pushes into it? And then just thinks it's a turned on furnace. I I th I think so. Yeah, I think I think that is like a similar case. Um. So if I go beep boop boop like that, and then uh, pop up like that, and then I think this has to be sticky as well. Lock, and then if we put a redstone torch here, perfect. Okay, so now this is powered. Um. Uh. So this this block here is bud powered, and furnaces normally can't be moved by pistons but when you mm -hmm. update it and it's changing state it, it can be moved kind of like uh or like sand you mm -hmm. know falling sand it's oh, not yeah. it's not the same as like a block you know i think it's the i think it's the same as that so pretty much basically all you need to do now in fact i'll give you uh you have some wood on you actually if you put yeah. some wood in the furnace to make it uh -huh. to make it lit 
There you go. It oh. pushes to the side, and now and then, you look yeah, in it. it has there's no nothing in there, in and it's uh, yeah, and it's powered. Yeah. Yeah. Right on my balcony. Right on your balcony. The perfect yeah, place for it, really. <laughs> Wait. Did it take all my wood? Uh, no, I actually grabbed some of it. So there's... Oh, okay. Yeah, it, it dropped it out. Or at least some of it. I don't know how much you put so, in. But... Fix my walls. Oh, yeah. I actually have some as well, so I can help you. Is that fixed? I think that's fixed. Uh, yeah. Fixed. Perfect. So yeah, that's right. a that's a furnace that will burn forever, and uh, yeah, it does actually produce light as well, so you don't have to, um, like, you can actually use these as a lighting source if you want. <laughs> uh, that would, yeah, that would make it unique. It would be, yeah, it would be, but it's kind of cool. Like, if you want, like, a uh, you know, a, a blacksmith or something, that's you know, the furnace is always going. Um, it's kind of a kind of a unique one. I think I think it's been used a few times, maybe on the server. I'm not sure. So pretty simple so far. <laughs> Now we move mm -hmm. on to the wonderful world of update suppression, Jaren. Yeah, I'm looking forward to this. I'm looking forward to this. Yeah, this is the this is the this is the big one. So, um, this one is yeah, this one's this one's really funky. Um, did it stop raining? It stopped raining it just in time. It was fate. It was fate, Jaren. I'm gonna turn up my volume. Uh, this is. This is support we're doing or is there multiple update suppression so things? I'm gonna I'll, I'll start by showing you just like the small ones like the you know the little fun things you can do and then I'll show you the portal <laughs> the big one at the end okay, of the portal awesome. right? <laughs> oh shoot I, I should have grabbed some glowstone it's fine uh, I'll do it later um okay so this one is also directional um I think if we do it if we do it this way we should be good so if I place that there with that there so this one also has to do with like the uh the ID ID state of the blocks um, this is why we use pink wool, like here, um, because it has a specific ID, um, which helps, uh, helps turn it into what you're about to see, which might look very similar to what we saw earlier. So yeah. if I do that... What exactly? It's oh, look at... Yeah, it's okay. the same thing. Yeah, so this is, seems like it's the same thing, but this actually has some special properties about it, which, uh, okay. much smarter people, um, can explain. I, uh... I don't understand it enough to to be able to explain it. Unfortunately, is there something we would obviously be able to tell that's different about it? Not not just by looking at it. Not just by looking at it. Um, so if I now put oh oh <laughs> oh yeah okay cool <laughs> you're okay. you're learning you're learning <laughs> yeah that so, didn't happen last time yeah so that is a uh, oh okay this block has yeah some some different kind of properties to it. Which, uh, yeah, you don't want to mess with. So, which direction do I need to be in? I think I need oh. to... <laughs> stop messing with it, dude. Well. You gotta stop... You gotta like, stop, well, you gotta stop powering this block. <laughs> okay. Alright, so if I put a door here... I, uh, okay, that's gonna face the wrong way. So this one's a bit, uh, funky. It's, it's directional, um, and... Uh, so you gotta kind of work out which way is gonna work. So I think this way should work. So let me jump up here. So basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to, yeah, so I'll give you a little platform to stand on if you want to stand here. So my viewing area. So this is similar as well. I'm going to bud power this uh, piston block here. And at the mm -hmm. same time, I'm going to break the door. And after I start breaking the door, I'm going to step on this pressure plate and bud power it. And then when I break the door, it should like kind of glitch it and make it uh like stop it from half door yeah half door exactly so if i do that and then step on the pressure plate there we go now the thing about this is it does uh log you out of your game uh, uh -huh. when you do it but as you can see we now have yeah it's like a uh, fence door. gate yeah exactly and it works which is cool and you can do this you can do that with uh with an iron door as well, but the problem is if you power it, it uh, it it disappears. Um, so that is, this, yeah, this is actually this works. such a cool one. Yeah, this one's cool. I there use... are no uh, fence gates in beta Minecraft. So yeah, you have awkward entrances. So the closest thing um that I knew of before this was actually uh like way simpler. Um, if I I'll quickly throw it together. If you zero tick it with a with a piston, so if I put a block here and a piston there. Um, if you zero tick it uh, by breaking and placing a torch like super quick, you can actually make it float. Oh. Um, and this can is the. Can I flip it? 
yeah, you can flip it. Um, if you place blocks next to it, it will update. But you can, like, this is what we used to do for, like, trapdoors, uh, for fence gates, sorry. <laughs> mm -hmm. Is have it kind of be like this, so you'd walk through. Oh. So you'll see a lot of these around the server um, as, like, kind of, you know, entrances to, um, I don't know, entrances to... You know, places you enter. Yeah, 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 exactly, <laughs> places you enter. But this is, like, a, a, a cooler one, I think. Um, I, I really, I really quite like this. I'm actually yeah. starting throwing this around. Yeah. I used it, I think I used it in my, in my wheat farm, so, um, yeah, it's a pretty cool one. But, okay, so, moving on, we've got more update suppression to do. Uh, the cool thing about this block that I'm about to make is you can actually piston it around as well. Um, so you don't have to keep making a new one. Um, I will say it is a little dangerous to use in, uh, single player, because it's... Uh, like it, it obviously it crashes your game. So uh -huh. um, and beta is like you know a bit 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 sketchy in terms of <laughs> yeah like mm -hmm. saving your game and you know saving all your files and stuff. It's very easy Wait, to crash. That pressure plate. Sorry. The pressure plate. Yeah. I want to do something because you you got banned when you. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> oh, so we could make landmines around the that, server. That is true, actually. I didn't even think of that. That's actually so true. Oh, uh, oh no. Wait, okay. wait, wait, wait. Don't do anything. Oh, sorry. I broke it. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah it basically, was... you, you wouldn't be able to log back in there for a while. <laughs> that is that is yeah. so devious. I didn't even think of this. See, look at you. You just if come up. As well, just... uh, part two, we start you putting these around the server. And oh, be God. Evil that would be. Oh, you know who? Okay, uh, you know the boy Ryan. He has pressure plates everywhere, all over his base. He like you make them everywhere there. He's gonna be so screwed. <laughs> Bye. It, it, okay, this one just fully crashed my game. Did I gotta it? reset everything. <laughs> Damn. Well, I think that's better. Is like you. I can't just log back in. Exactly. Yeah. It, it, it'll because you because you keep pressure stepping on the pressure plate as you log back in. It just keep crashes you. Uh -huh. <laughs> all right. So this is gonna be basically the same thing. Um, I I should have obsidian block so like i don't break it too early um but basically same thing I'm gonna start breaking this and then step on this pressure plate now we're gonna have to wait 30 million years for this uh, obsidian to break that's just the way it is in beta i'm sorry to say that i just haven't enchanted my uh my my, my sword just yet there we go there it goes <gasps> loading rail so now we have a floating rail <laughs> What are the implications of this? Like, what can I do with it? So, with this, I mean, again... Can I put a minecart on top? You actually can. I came prepared. Oh, my God. <laughs> so floating these... chair. Floating chair. No yeah. way. <laughs> Yo, this is my favorite one now. I know. This, this is pretty cool. cool. Yeah, it's pretty cool. And, it, you know, if you... So, right now, if you right-click, see how you fell through? Could be a cool secret mm -hmm. base entrance, actually. Like, if you, if you put blocks around this, you know... You know, you fall straight through it, so could be an interesting secret base. This is entrance. how you get to the bottom floor. <laughs> Genius. <laughs> oh, that, is... okay. that was a substantial fall. <laughs> so yeah, this one's pretty cool, and you can uh, basically make floating. You can basically make floating anything. So uh, let me. Uh... Oh, a floating ladder. Yeah. Exactly. So if I put that there I'll and then watch from my new favorite chair. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Look at that! That floating ladder. Yeah. Ooh, there goes my chair. And it actually works as well. Oh my god! It's. Oh uh, really? It yeah, it works as what well. It? Oh, it's in. It's invisible like on a... one side as well. Yeah, it doesn't work on that side though. Yeah. But. It's like a one-way glass. Yeah. It's See, kinda... I can spy on you. <gasps> That's actually kind of. I didn't even think about it. Oh, it's kind of cool. Oh, it's it's kind okay. of it, it's it's kind of like a barrier. I didn't even think about this, but it's kind of like a barrier block in a way. Like you you can see it, mm -hmm. but you can't really do anything about it. But yeah, it works, which is cool. So yeah, floating, and you can make. I've got I've got other things like, I've you know, if you want me to make a floating cake, I can make a floating we, cake. I've got we could put this in front of and someone's stuff. door. Okay, man, I think oh, we yeah. gotta make a part two. <laughs> yeah, we just definitely do evil things with this. They just. <laughs> Dude, you're just like definitely uh, need to I'm do back from that. my mining trip. Walk into it. <laughs> Walk into a floating ladder. Yeah. Yeah. I like. Okay. This is this is why we keep you around because like you know <laughs> you're coming up with these dubious ideas that that will definitely definitely be great prank ideas that I've literally never even thought of. That's such a great idea. <laughs> 
Okay. <laughs> Look, you yeah, peek. That's funny. You're like, you're like peeking through the little like oh. slats or whatever. <laughs> this is how we spy on people. Yeah. But like, you know, again, this could be a cool decoration block as well. You know, like you put this on a window like that. Or you put this on the glass, you know, because I, I don't think you can normally put ladders on glass. So, you know, you could find a way. I uh, know. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna. I'm so gonna be using these for so much decoration box, Blair. <laughs> yeah. Decorate the whole server. Yeah, exactly. And and uh, you can also make same same as this. I brought. I did bring a sign, but I think you know. I think you get the gist. You can also make floating mm -hmm. signs as well, just like floating in midair, not connected to anything. Like same same as this, um, which is cool. So mm -hmm. yeah. All right. Now on to the main event. Oh, and you can also make tables. Uh, now onto the main event. Tables. Uh, Wait, with what? So if you put like a All right, let pressure me, okay. plate, you're saying? Yeah, exactly. So in oh, okay. so in beta, like, I mean, you can try. I'll, I'll put a fence there. I don't know if you have a pressure. I've plate tried on. that so many it times. Try and put a pressure plate on top of a yeah, fence. It for doesn't. A table. It doesn't work, right? But if you go, if you go like this, actually, this is a good segue. You know what? This is a great segue into what we're about to do next. So I'll do it. <laughs> Sweet. This is a good segue into what we're gonna do next. I'm very curious what it's gonna be. Okay, so let me stop breaking this. Get rid of that. What if I touch the pressure plate? Uh, it'll just uh, maybe don't touch it yet, but nothing, nothing will happen. It'll just, it'll just push down. Oh, oh. and you'll crash. Okay. Mm. And now, now you've okay. Now you've flattened the pressure plate as well, which is. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> but that's okay. Okay. How it, do it, I get out of here without breaking the pressure plate? Uh, okay. It's hey, fine. Dude, it's fine. Yeah. The pressure plate's gone. <laughs> we can just make a new one. It's fine. Yeah, <laughs> You just but you just wanna you just wanna watch me suffer and break obsidian over and over, don't you? <laughs> don't touch the pressure plate. <laughs> I won't touch it. I'm I'm back here. Yeah, you gotta learn. I got the ladder in, in front of me. <laughs> it's holding him back, the invisible ladder. Okay, so something cool about update suppression is you can like basically doubly update suppress. So right now if I wait, where's that what, do you have that fence? Yes. Um so okay, so Basically, right now, if I place this fence under here, it'll get rid of the uh, the, the the pressure plate there. But if I step mm -hmm. on this pressure plate here, so now update suppressing, and I place this, I will crash. But oh, now we you now have, have a table. table exactly. And the thing is, people who don't play beta Minecraft, they'll be like, oh, whatever, it's just a table. You know, we've seen that a billion million times. But in beta Minecraft, you know that this is this is, this this is, is you a... can't do this naturally. Exactly, this is, this is illegal. Um, yeah. Uh, but it's what a cool I, table. Uh, stand on it. Yeah, you can stand on it. You actually can't. Uh, I was gonna say you actually can't stand on the pressure plate. Technically, you're standing on the fence right now. So if I, I'll jump up and oh, I'll show you. Right. You can see, I'm like above the pressure plate. <laughs> because oh, so you're not actually pressing it down. Yeah, because fences are like a one and a half block tall yeah, thing. Hitboxes. Yeah, the hitbox is like huge. All right, now on to the main event. Let's move over here where there's a bit more space. Yeah? yeah? This is the portal? This is the portal. This is the portal. Frick yeah. So, the problem with making portals is it takes a long time because obsidian is like a pain to, a pain to, to break. Um, uh -huh. So, um, there is a way to make like half portals and then there's a way to make like the full portal. Um, I'll show you just briefly how to do, um, how to do it so you can kind of just get the idea. One, two, three... I'm not going to do the corners, all right? Don't tell Ether. Because I'm sure you know him. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm, I'm not buddies with Ether. Damn it. You should be. All right, no, I'm going to... Hermitcraft, Hermitcraft still is, like, a just totally different side of the Minecraft sphere. It eludes you. One day. Yep. Yep. All right, uh, I'm going to turn down my sounds because nether portal sounds are atrociously loud. So, we have a nether portal. Um, mm -hmm. Again directional uh update suppression so i know that it, i definitely know that it works i don't want to waste waste more time so I, I i definitely know it works this way so i'm gonna i'm gonna make it this way and then so this is update suppressing so right now it's Does doing that allow you well right now to... it's right now it's doing nothing but if i place this pressure plate down and then i start breaking the block that the uh the um the piston is touching it'll get rid of the the obsidian. Oh, and then we're gonna have a portal. Oh, am I stepping on that? Okay, there we go. It'll and work. that is a cursed portal. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> no way. Yeah. 
So that's uh, that's how you get rid of the obsidian. And I haven't pers personally myself. I haven't spent the time to make like a full um, double like double portal like this with no obsidian. I think, mm -hmm. as far as I know, the best way, like the most effective way to do that is to make like a bunch of these and put them on every single obsidian, um, and then like update suppress them each one at a time. Yeah, um, I you think have that's, like, to the have this way. touching the obsidian for every single one you break. Yeah, exactly. Wow. And okay, so what's cool about this as well is that if the exact same thing with the fences, if I I wish I had some glowstone, but if I if I stand on the pressure plate again and then I place a block. Oh, dude, I'm so gonna have to do this. You can make you make can a make a fake portal. A fake portal, exactly. So I've seen people make you know the aether portal uh, with mm -hmm. the with the glowstone um, instead of the obsidian, which is pretty yeah, cool. Yeah, I have some glowstone. Let me go grab. Okay, I don't have any on me, but. Yeah, I'll go grab some. All right. Glowstone, right on. Ten glowstone, perfect. I, I, I don't know if we want to. I don't use think. It all. I don't know if we. I don't know if we're gonna update separate. Like, is it takes a long time, you know? <laughs> I don't think we're gonna make an aether portal right now, but we can at least put a glowstone in the. Uh, unless you want mm. to. Box player, box player, <laughs> let down your hair. <laughs> I got lush, luscious gold locks. My hero. <laughs> oh, don't catch yourself on fire on the lit <laughs> furnace. That's really a f way to put outside. It's a real fire hazard. You see this place? Yeah, this place is a tinderbox. Oh, yeah. Is I don't know a... why we're using fire lit torches. Where's Captain Cat? He's, he's, we need a, he's, he's part of the fire department. All right, so I'll step on this, and then you place the block. I don't know if this will crash you or me, but... Okay, crash you. Cool. Me. That's nice. <laughs> nice that you get crashed for once. There we go. Now we have a one-tenth aether... Nine tenths nether. <laughs> exactly. All right, so I can also show you. Hopefully, this works with the same uh, same portal. We'll see. We'll give it a try. Oh, there's more. There is more. But wait, there there's more. more. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> what so else can we do with the portal? If I if I push this, uh, oops. Oh, okay, it updated. Never mind. Oh. My bad. I'm gonna have to break your glowstone. I'm sorry. If you didn't, if you didn't get full back, I'll repay you. It's okay. I got three. <laughs> no. Okay. Wait. Wait a minute. What? I still have ten glowstone in my inventory. We've duped. Did we? Did we dupe? Did we just find a dupe? Did we just dupe? <laughs> that could be a. <laughs> that actually, a that actually could be a dupe. <laughs> I think we just. <laughs> I think we accidentally yeah. just found a dupe. Yeah, I think we just. That 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 will dupe glowstone. I think. I think so. I think it's because. I placed it down and then and I was like I update crashed. suppressing maybe yeah maybe yeah you're the one update suppressing interesting oh that's interesting okay we would do that with a few uh, diamond blocks <laughs> uh, okay so I am very broke right now you're very broke what have you been spending your money on huh I I just don't have any money oh, you just don't spend. you just never had money that's the problem with being broke. <laughs> And then I go to your base, and you have 15 diamond blocks <laughs> in the chest. Um, go, excuse oh, me, I have I like 20 odd well diamond blocks, thank you. Oh my gosh, she's gonna make a house out of them. I'm so rich, yeah, exactly, it's creative mode. Um, I think, I think it doesn't matter which obsidian I break. I'm gonna just try and break this one. Um, I don't think it matters which one I break. Oh! You got a half portal. To get the half portal? Yeah, nice, there we go. Oh. Look at that, and it still yeah. works. Yeah, it, it still, still works. Cool. Yeah, so this is what I have at my base currently, except I ended up getting rid of all of the obsidian, which took a while. Um, have you seen this half of a portal block? Yeah. Oh, the uh, like the inside. Yeah, it's kind of cool, huh? Yeah. It's weird because the side of these portal blocks has a has like a texture, but the underside and the top like don't. Which is oh, strange. Really? Yeah, like it's 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 weird. It's like it's like notch it was like yeah, people are gonna kind of be able to see the side of the nether portal Oh, block. he saw update suppression when he coded this game. Yeah, he totally, he figured like, it they're out. They're going to find this weird <laughs> configuration of pistons and pink wall. Exactly. They're going to know. They're going to find out. But yeah, uh -huh. this one's pretty cool. I really like this one. And the same, you can do the same thing again where you put like um, blocks um, in this in this space here um, so that you can make it, you know, a one by, you know, a one by three portal um, with, you know, a frame as well. Mm -hmm. Um you know, a unique frame, if you want. Um, because, you know, in, in in beta, you know, again, in beta, you can't make portals that are bigger than 2x3. 
Um, that's yeah. like the biggest portal you can make. Um, well, it's the only portal you can make. Um, so it, you know, having having a portal that's uh, one by three, like odd like this, is, the, the is skinny awesome. Portal. Yeah, which is good because you know, so like you you've seen our uh, um, our portal at uh, at the shopping area. You know how it's got like the two portals side by side. With the obsidian uh, in the middle, yeah. Like that was to make it so that it was like centered. But this way, you only you would only need this one, you know. Ooh, you just so need this one to have centered portal. Yeah. So if I want yeah. to remove these, I'd have to update suppress them before I do that. Yeah, you'd have to update suppress them. Um, okay. To to remove them, yeah. So you'd have to put the uh, the the glitch piston block on each obsidian and break it. Mhm. Mm so. Well, yeah, it's we'll a tedious. It like this. It's a tedious. It's a tedious project for sure, but. It is very, very cool in the end. Dude, look at this. Now this is going to be in my mansion. <laughs> causing a ruckus. I hope this doesn't uh, doesn't mess with the uh, the portal that's already over here. But oh! We'll see. We might have to... That'd be pretty good. People we... come to my base and they have to go take the tour. They ha yeah, they yeah, have to see everything. What do you think all these new directions? Uh, the, the decorations. <laughs> decorations. Honestly, I mean, it's better than it was before. You had nothing. Look, you've even got a, you've got a table. <laughs> you've got a you've got a table. You've got a seat. There's no you know? feng shui here. It's just a table. <laughs> uh, yeah, but a like... A chair. The chairs are not supposed to be higher than the table. Oh, well, well I don't know. We... What do you oh, want? What do you want from me? I just have a trap door right in the middle. <laughs> what do you want from me? I'm not. I'm not an interior here. designer, right? You're not paying me anything to to design anarchy. your house. <laughs> Down here we have a one block wide coffee table, and then just an assortment whatever of this things. Is. <laughs> it's a it's and a garbage disposal. Oh, I totally forgot about this invisible block. Oh yeah. <laughs> well, if we make a few of those, do you have the stairs, right? All right, put it in. And now we have <laughs> my uh, new installation, <laughs> water. Water. Yeah, you can wash your feet in there. I like that you can just walk straight into it as well. You don't have to, like, jump up and whatever. Yeah. Yeah. Well, this would be great for, like, you fall down from, like, a half, uh, high distance. You come oh, in yeah, you sleep. walk in and you can just walk out. It's, yeah, that's true. You don't need to worry about, like, signs or anything like that. Mm-hmm. Um, Dude, this was awesome. Yeah, that's pretty much everything I had uh, had planned to show you. There's uh, there's definitely like a few more like you know niche things out there, but that's that's the basics of everything um, that you need to know. Ah, actually, I'm I'm kind of like starving right now, so I might I might eat this cake that I brought along. When did you bring a cake? Well, I br <laughs> I, I actually brought two cakes because I wanted to. I was gonna I was gonna update suppress a, a floating cake for you, so but I might just do that now. Uh, <laughs> leave I, a cake on my front lawn. Yeah, I brought a bunch of I brought a bunch of things to update suppress. <laughs> like so that you could uh you could just have them, but let me put that let me put this oh actually I need a uh What's the under of a cake look like? That is something I genuinely think I have never seen. Well, like I've seen the underside of a cactus. I've never seen the underside of a cake. Well, we're about to find out because I also don't think I've ever seen the underside of a cake. I mean, does it have to be obsidian? It can't be any. Block. No, it doesn't have to be obsidian. The reason I use obsidian is because um, you have to start breaking the obsidian and then step on the pressure plate. If you, oh. but if you break the block, you know, before whatever, like it, it yeah, it, it, it just doesn't. Doesn't work, dude. I, look at this. I've never seen the underside of a cake. Come get a look at this. I'll have a look. Does it look interesting, or is it exactly what you'd expect? Uh, kind of, but oh. like kind of not what you'd expect. They're just That's dots. Weird. Yeah, it's like it. It's like. To be fair, the whole cake is not very textured, is it? It's a weird. It's a weird texture. I've never looked this so in depth at a cake before. <laughs> that is right. It kind of looks like. Like a plastic cake. Yeah, a little bit. Uh, it's like a play toy yeah, it cake. A yeah. It's like a sponge cake. Yeah, can I eat this or will it go away? Uh, I'm not sure. Yeah, we'll just leave it floating there. I'm not hungry anyways. Nah, you should try it. We gotta we gotta for science, you gotta well, try it. Okay, okay, give me a second. Thank <laughs> you. Hey, it Ooh. works. There we go, that's cool. Let's see for science. You gotta you gotta find these things out. Is there is there anything different about the underside? No, the exact same. <laughs> is it just like cut? Yeah. 